Today I have a monochromatic winter makeup look for you guys. I haven't done like a dark lip and a dark glossy lip in so long. Like this is giving me like old London vibes. Like wow. Just finished my eyebrows and everything. I did them off camera. Now let's all move on to skin. Um, I've been really loving this product recently. This is the Too Faced Hangover RX Good In Bed Serum, hydrating serum. It has hyaluronic acid and everything. Hyaluronic acid, coconut water, dragon fruit, and vitamin B5. So I've just been using this in with my skincare, not just um, with makeup. So I'm just gonna put some of that on my skin. Instantly gives you a glow to the skin, and it also acts as another like tacky base on your face to make your foundation stick. Um, I kind of want to try a new primer today, but I'm scared because I haven't tried like a new primer in so long. So y'all know I usually go in with the Milk Hydro Grip primer, but I think I want to try the, the Tatcha Silk Canvas primer and apply it to the face. It smells good, so. This feels very weird. Like it definitely feels, the texture is different than my um, Hydro Grip. Like my Hydro Grip is very hydrating. Um, and you can instantly feel it working with this you just it doesn't feel like anything my pores look okay so i have a new palette for us to play with today i just picked up the nikita dragon palette um from morphe and y'all these colors so here's what the palette looks like it's gorgeous i didn't think i was gonna like this palette um just based off what I saw online. But when I went in store, I went in for something completely different and I came out with this palette. Um, let me just show you. I swatched it already so the colors might look, you know, misplaced. But here's what it looks like. Super pretty. I don't think the camera's doing it justice, but this top row up here, these top two rows, my type of colors. So I think we're gonna do today like a brown, I feel like I already did that, but I want to do like a monochromatic makeup look. If I keep looking down here, I'm sorry, I'm looking in the the monitor because this is a new camera and I just want to make sure everything is... I think I'm going to take the shade Prima Donna, which is this like neutral tan-ish kind of brown right here. Um, and I'm just going to go for it. I'm gonna take the shade Seduction on a Do Care number 14 brush and I'm just gonna pack that on top. Okay, pigmentation. Y'all see that? I'm gonna take the shade Temptation, which is like a dark brown, and I'm gonna be using a MAC 224 brush and popping that in. Oh yeah. In my crease. Now this is my type of shade. It's not dark enough though. Like I want it to be. Hmm. I'm 
going to be taking the shade Papi Chulo, which is like a really pretty iridescent brown shimmer. Let me swatch it for you guys so you guys can really see what it looks like. That's really cute. So I'm going to be taking that and I'm placing that all over my lid. I'm going to spray my brush first with the Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. And we're just going to pack that all over. little detailed brush this is the do care number 24 brush um, spraying this as well I'm gonna be taking um, 703 which is like a champagne gold type color and placing this on the inner parts Stunning. Just with that same brush we use for the shade Temptation, I'm gonna go ahead and buff up the edges a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead and add some liner. This is the Urban Decay 24 7 Glide on Eye Pencil in the shade Perversion. I'm gonna put some of that perversion on the back of my hand, kind of like break it off, and use like a flat shader. For the most part, the eyes are done um, with the exception of my water lower lash line. And then I'm just going to go ahead and put on some lashes and then finish my other eye off camera. And I've got eight all day and it is 4.30. It's 4.30. Sis has not ate all day. So now on to complexion. My eyelashes are bothering me right now. Um... But yeah, so now I'm going to complexion. We put all this away. Um, I already primed my face. Did y'all see that? I hope y'all didn't see that. But I already primed my face earlier and moisturized it and everything. So now we're going to go on to skincare. Um, as you guys know, I've been doing my face a little differently. I'm not going to go ahead. I'm not going to go too in-depth with doing my skincare today because I feel like, or my complexion today because I feel like I've, I have a detailed video on that so if you guys are gonna want to watch it I'm gonna leave it on the screen but I'm gonna just you know kind of listen to some music jam out and yeah so that's what I'm about to do
Okay, so while my nose is baking, I'm going to go ahead and finish off my lower lashes, um, my lower lash line. I'm going to take the shade Seduction, which is that burnt orange type of color, on a Colorbop number 9 brush. And just drag that along the bottom. Taking that um, shade Temptation, which is the dark brown that we use on a Do Care number 25 brush, I'm just gonna go go ahead and pack that um, between where I put the burnt orange and the um, black eyeliner. Taking that same little detailed brush I used for the black shade, I'm just going to go ahead and smudge that in my waterline. So now that this is done, I'm going to go ahead and go in with the mascara. This is my favorite um, right now. This is the Damn Girl mascara by Too Faced and I'm just gonna go ahead and coat the hell out of these bottom lashes because 
I have none and I need it to look full. I just need, I need a lot of bottom lashes right now, so. Oh, shit. Damn, I'm just so clumsy. It just doesn't make sense. I just love this mascara. It makes me look like I have something on lashes and I don't. I promise you I don't have bottom lashes. I'm gonna go ahead and wipe this bake away. I think I'm gonna bake. I never do this, but I'm gonna like bake under my cheeks. Right here. Only for a second though. I'm actually about to wipe it away now. Um, just cause I feel like I can never bake with powders because I'm dark skinned. So it just always leaves like a white cast on me, even if it says it's translucent, but yeah, that's good. Translucent powder really is like a <laughs> makeup eraser. Um, I'm going to go ahead and set my face. This is the Continuous Setting Mist by Morphe. And I've really been loving this one lately. This is the Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray by Charlotte Tilbury. Especially if you wear masks, I feel like this is a perfect setting spray because it doesn't make your makeup budge. Like your makeup just stays in place all day, so. And it smells really good. Okay, so definitely been reaching more towards this palette recently this is the hyper real glow by mac um yeah i've definitely been reaching more towards this so i'm gonna be taking the middle shade and this shade actually i might be just mixing all three because or like the middle shade and the darker one I love doing my lips and just like the different lip combinations I can do. So today I'll be using the Toasted Lip Liner by TMC Cosmetics. Um, I'll leave a link down below. You guys can check it out. This is literally the, one of the best lip liners. Like it's up there with my KKW. My lips are lined. I'm gonna be taking the Maybelline I don't even super stay matte ink in the shade protector. This is just like a dark brown type of color. Mm -hmm. I haven't worn a dark lip like this in so long.
while. I haven't worn a dark lip like this in so long. Okay. And then, you guys know I have to go in with the gloss. Although, this is very pretty. Like, I feel like this is, this is, this is hot. Um, I'm going to take the TMC Not Ordinary Lip Gloss. It's just a brown lip gloss. And put this on top. Oh yeah, this is perfect. Y'all, this is perfect. <gasps> wow. I'm gonna go in with my Wet n Wild liquid eyeliner. Ooh. And I'm just gonna go ahead and place, do my little dots, my moles around my face, my beauty marks. So like one right here. There we go. This is cute. It's giving cute. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and fix my hair and then I'll come back on camera when the whole look is complete. <laughs> Alright y'all, so that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this little brown sparkly gold monochromatic moment. It's a look. Especially for the winter time, it's it's a hit it's that one um i really love it i haven't done like a makeup look like this in so long so this is definitely bringing me back to the old old london vibes um <laughs> yeah thank you guys so much for watching and tuning into my channel don't forget to like comment and subscribe and follow all my socials follow them so you can see more of me um but yeah i'm on i'm on literally everything uh tiktok instagram i sound so old i sound old let me stop um